Okay, hi, this is Mr. Coombe. Let's do another gas stoichiometry question. Pause this video so that you can actually read the question and let's solve it out. Here we have, uh, first thing we need to do here is let's write out the equation. So we have solid iron. So whenever you're writing out an actual uh, metal, it's going to be the metal by itself. Solid iron reacts with sulfuric acid, H2SO4, and that's going to be usually an aqueous solution. Those two react to produce iron 2, iron 2 sulfate, SO4, and that's going to be aqueous because it's dissolved in that um, acidic solution. Uh, and you produce hydrogen gas. Beautiful. Now, if we have a look, this reaction actually is already balanced, so we don't need to do any um, excess balancing. So now we can go straight into it. We have uh, a volume of our we have a volume of our beautiful hydrogen gas. So we can find out the number of moles of our hydrogen gas is going to be 0 0.65 liters over 22.71 according to Avogadro's law, which is about 2.86 by 10 to the negative 2 mole. Now according to our ratio, according to our actual um, to our actual uh, reaction here, the number of moles, because we want to know eventually the mass of iron 2 sulfate, the number of moles of our iron 2 sulfate is actually the same as the number of moles of hydrogen produced. Awesome, which is 2.86 by 10 to the negative 2 moles. So easy here, then the mass of our FeSO4 is going to be the number of moles, which is 2.86 by 10 to the negative 2 mole, times its molar mass, which is about 151.92 grams per mole. And that should give us a mass of approximately 4.34 grams to three significant figures. And there we go. Problem solved.